we're back here with another video. It's gonna be our top five lipsticks. Yeah. Okay. Oh, so. before I before we go into that, um, uh, we actually after our Easter giveaway, we sent out all the um, gifts and prizes, and um, someone sent us another letter, and it's a thank you card. Isn't that so cute? And it's like shimmery. I don't know if you guys can tell. But um, yeah, it's from Amanda. Should I read it? No, right? Should I? No, I don't think so. No. Should but um, yeah, thank you, Amanda, for um, sending us a card. And um, we really appreciate everything and your support. Alright, so let's jump right in. Um, it's not in any particular order. I'm just going to go ahead and, you know, mention it. Um, this is the Fairy Glen which is my all-time favorite. Um, Melina actually got me a backup of this one, so I'm excited to finish this one up. My next favorite is Sarah, and this is by Sila, and this one has been through a lot because it melted in my car, and it's all corroded and everything. Um, but Sila doesn't come out with lipsticks anymore, I believe, but this isn't Sarah, and I really like the detailing of the packaging. It's so gorgeous. Um... The third one I have here is just Revlon Soft New, which is also corroded because it <laughs> melted in my car, but Melina did get me a backup of this, so that's alright. Um, and the next one right here is YSL in number one, and it's like a really nice, like kind of like a corally pink almost um, color, so that's that. And the last one I have here, which I also mentioned before, I believe in our favorites, it's Coquette by Lime Crime. And these are all mostly like nude shades because I, re I really like nude lipsticks. I was going to put that one in mine, the <laughs> yeah. Coquette, but I was like, eh, whatever. Okay, so my all-time favorite ever is um, Innocence Beware um, from that Villains collection. It looks like that. This is my favorite, beyond favorite. I have a backup of that. And then the next one I have is um, Max Hue. Oh, I forgot to mention that. That is definitely one of my favorites, too. <laughs> yeah, like, it was so hard for us to choose, and I cheated, and I chose six. Um, then this is the upper hip, and it just actually came out, and it's limited edition. I bought it back of this one, too. And um, it's so gorgeous. It's like a coral. And then I also have Revlon Soft Nude. So pretty. I have a back of this, too. And then I have Bobbi Brown's Old Hollywood, and it's a red. Gorgeous. Then I have Maybelline's Pink Please, and I'm so sad they discontinued this. I should have bought a backup, but whatever. It's so pretty. It's such a pretty pink. And that is all. <laughs> so here are the swatches of the lipstick that I mentioned. Um, this one's MAC Fairy Glen, which came out from the Tarte and Tail collection, I believe. So that one's discontinued, sadly. Um, this one was Sarah by Stila. This one right here is... Um, Revlon, uh, what is this Soft called? Nude. Soft Nude, yeah. Soft Nude right over there. And then the one right next to that is the YSL number one. <laughs> and then the last one is the Lime Crime in Coquette. So they're pretty similar in shade, because once again, like I said, I really like nude shades and lighter colors. So that's that. Okay, I'm going to do my swatches now. I'm not going to do the Soft Nude one because she already showed it. But um, this one is the Innocence Beware. This is Hue. Um, this one is Ever Hip. Look at that, it's so pretty. Old Hollywood and Maybelline's um, Pink Please. So yeah, gorgeous, gorgeous. So that basically sums up our top five favorites. So yeah, stay tuned for more videos and thank you guys for watching. Thanks, bye! bye. Hey guys! Oh! I forgot to tell you something! You scared the crap out of me! <laughs>